Hello guys, this is Amos Style Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play a song called Pure Imagination from Willy Wonka. Okay, so let's get right into it. There are five main sections in this song and then you can see it's actually the second, third, fourth and fifth section is the part that actually repeats itself and like you can do all these variations with it. Okay, but anyways, here we go. So uh, the first section is a really simple section. It goes like this. It's like this descending motive. Three note motive, repeat it for as many times as you want like this. Yeah, like that, and you just repeat it and have this mysterious sound to it. Okay, it can be like, yeah, for you guys to wait for the people to pay attention to you and then you start playing the main theme. But anyways, the main theme is really easy here. Um, what occurs? The right hand is actually supposed to be an octave higher. But you can't see the keys, that's why we're doing an octave below here, okay? But I'll teach you the three notes right now. So it starts on the B flat above. And then down more than an octave stretch to the A, and then to the B flat next to it. And that's the three notes, and you just repeat it. So, like that. And you just repeat it for as many times as you want before you want to start the main theme, okay? Yeah. Okay, after that, it goes to section two. Section two, give you a quick preview right now. It goes like this, okay? So, you can actually see. Okay, this is what I have when I play the cover. It's really simple like that. It's just chords and melody. So that's exactly what I'm gonna teach you in this lesson. Everything else are just improvisations I made up on the spot, like um, when I played the cover. So every single time I play it is different. But I'll yeah, teach you approximately what I kinda did as well in the cover that I've done. Okay, so here we go. I'll give you a preview of the second section right now. So it goes like this. Okay, so let's go ahead and learn it right now. So, um, okay, right hand for the first part goes like this. Goes, uh, starting on the B flat, middle C, C, I'll go up, up to that B flat. It goes B flat up to D flat, up to A flat, back down to B flat, D flat, A flat, and then down to B flat, D flat, up to the C, D flat, C, D flat, C, D flat, C, A flat. And that's the first part. So there's two parts for this first, uh, this second section, okay? So one more time, so it goes like this. B flat, D flat, A flat, repeat. B flat, D flat, A flat, and then B flat, D flat, up to C. And then we have uh, three times of D flat, C. One, two, three, and then A flat, like that, simple. Okay, so that's that for the right hand for the first part. Once you get that left hand, we have three chords here. The three chords are E flat minor, which is E flat, G flat, B flat. Second chord is A flat major, which is A flat, C, E flat. And the third chord is D flat major, which is D flat, F, A flat. Just like that, okay? So yeah, with those three chords in mind, the turn together goes like this. Right hand starts first, A flat and E flat minor together. Right hand continues. A flat and A flat major to get up. C and D flat major to get up. Just like that, and that is the first part, okay? Just like that. Alright. So, one more time. To get To get To get Like that. Okay, even my cover, I did it really like free rhythm, okay? So like, you can really do anything of, uh, after you learn the melody and chords, okay? I'll tell you what you can do at the end of the whole lesson, okay? But anyway, right now, work out the melody and chords first because that forms everything as what i written before. Everything is written out like that, okay? So, okay, here we go. Uh, the second part for this second section, right hand continues, go down to the B flat, D flat, F, G flat, A flat, F, and then E flat, D flat, C, D flat, C, D flat, C, A flat. And that is the right hand for the second part. One more time. So it goes like this B flat, D flat, F, G flat, A flat, F, E flat, D flat, C, D flat, C, D flat, C, A flat. Yeah, just like that for the right hand. Left hand. Same three chords as the first part, as you recall, that's E flat minor, E flat, G flat, B flat, and then A flat major, which you know, 
A flat, C, E flat, and D flat major, which is D flat, F, A flat. Yeah, so with these three chords in mind, so E flat minor, A flat major, and D flat major, the two hands together goes like this, right hand starts first, F and E flat minor together, F and A flat major together, C and D flat major together. Like that. One more time, it goes like this. Together. 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 Like that. And that's the second section out of the way. Moving on to the third section. Third section, I'll give you a preview right now. It goes like this. Just like that, okay. So, pretty awesome stuff. It's a combination of like, uh, I guess, the chords and also the bass notes, okay. So here we go. Right hand for the first part goes like this. Uh, okay, so it goes, uh, let me see. Okay, the right hand's actually exactly the same uh, first part uh, as the right hand of the, uh, f uh, the other section that we just did. So just B flat, D flat, A flat, B flat, D flat, A flat, B flat, D flat up to C, and then the uh, three times of the D flat C. One, two, three, A flat. And that's the um, first part of this third section. Okay, one more time, it goes like this. B flat, D flat, A flat. B flat, D flat, A flat. B flat, D flat up to C, and then three times D flat C. One, two, three, A flat. And that's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have a combination of chords and bass notes, okay, so pay attention, we have seven elements here, so first three elements is the same three chords as we learned before, which is E flat, G flat, B flat, the E flat minor chord, and then A flat major, again, which is A flat, C, E flat, and the third chord is D flat major, which is D flat, F, A flat, and then we have bass notes, you can do it as octaves, or if you can't read an octave, just do individual notes, doesn't really matter, it's just a process, okay, so it goes D, E flat, E, F, B flat. Oh no, the B flat actually belongs to the uh, other part. Okay, so scrap the B flat at the end, just everything else apart from that. So it goes E flat minor, A flat major, D flat major, and then D, E flat, E, F. Okay? So do it these uh, first, okay? So one more time. So it goes E flat minor, A flat major, D flat major, and then D, E flat, E, F bass notes. Okay? This kind of goes up in like half steps, semitones, okay? So yeah, that's that. Okay, the right hand and the left hand is put together like this for this first part, so it goes. Right hand starts first. A flat and E flat minor together. A flat and A flat major together. C and D flat major together. And then the C and the D together. C and E flat together. C and E natural together. E, A flat and F together, like that. That is the first part of this third section. One more time, it goes like this. Like that. Okay, moving on to the second part. Right hand goes down to B flat, D flat, F. And then G flat, A flat, F. E flat, D flat, C. Up to the octave above C. And that's that for the right hand for the second part. One more time, so it goes like this. B flat, D flat, F. G flat, A flat, F. E flat, D flat, C. Up an octave to the high C. Just like that for the right hand. Okay, once you get that left hand, we have one bass note here. So the B flat bass note. And then we go back to chords. It's E flat minor, which is E flat, G flat, B flat. A flat major, which is A flat, C, E flat. And F major, which is F, A, C. Yeah, so four elements here, okay? So one more time, so it goes like this, so B flat bass note. So you can do it here or there if you want, doesn't matter. So B flat and the E flat minor chord, E flat, G flat, B flat, A flat major, and F major. Yeah, so with those four elements, let's put the turn together. So it goes B flat and the B flat together. F and E flat minor together. F and A flat major together. C and F major together. And hold that. And that's it for the third section. Moving on to the fourth section.